Hello! Actually, I'm already playing the game. I forgot. Um... There we go. I'm actually shuffling my people, because I have a bunch of people in the waiting room. Fair enough. I know who to fire and who to keep. Oh yeah, because I played a little bit more of the game off stream. I've started to get some of the more uh, interesting items. Keep playing off stream. Is I only played grinding? it for like two hours before like this stream. <laughs> Man. I did literally like three side ops and that was it. Well, and, and a main story mission, because I needed to remind myself how, like, it went for when we actually get to it together. The fuck? Wait. Like, the, the only actual grind we technically have to do to at least fully complete the main story is just to do, um, either redo the AI boss fights normally, or do the harder versions we unlock by that stage of the game. So it's kind of like, you know. I feel like this game, like, way of, like, putting people in rooms is complete, like, the auto sign is broken. It's putting the wrong people in. Oh? <laughs> How do you send people away again? I'll discharge. Uh, yeah. And then you can select multiple by hitting, like, yeah, yeah, yeah. um... Yeah. Square. Okay. Like... Can do or in the... Why is a person GMP super high but their combat rank sucks? I think I don't get... I, I, I assume, like, the better they have, like, any stat, the better the GMP is. I assume no, that's... No, that's not the oh. case here. You're well, I don't know. <laughs> I, I don't know what to tell you. Um... You're fired. How far off am I am to that? A little bit. Uh, yeah, you three go to shit. You're fired. Firing a bunch of dudes. I need to fire a single person here. Ah, oh, this guy has 420 life and 420 psych. I mean, that's pretty nice, but... Uh, you're also, like, absolute garbage, actually. Yeah, okay, well, I, I think I at... have everything. Wait, what the fuck? I have I have pots in my Intel team. Why did he know how to fill it? This, this game is weird. What the fuck? Maybe they might have like skills that work in those areas. I don't know. Like I know that there's some like skills you need to have characters with in order to build certain items and stuff like that. So maybe they'd be put into R and D. Even if their stats are shit, so you unlock those building recipes. Or I should say, like, weapon slash item ones. Every time you're doing your play, it's menu. Is this a menu game? Yeah, pretty much. Actually, yes. I, uh, I mean, it's, it's not that much, but... It's pretty much. I mean, if you put in the level of effort you're putting in, which is more optimum, but I'm a lazy fuck that just wants to play the next match. <laughs> uh, oh, this is almost gone. Oh, I have to then... Mm. Mm. Do, do we attempt the Monster Hunter mission is what I'm wondering. Uh, a good question. Probably best to like leave it for now, but maybe maybe we'll end the stream with that and we'll just attempt it and probably get our asses kicked and then call it. 
Yeah, I'll see it later. One second. I have to... You just... It should only take you, like, two seconds to unlock anyway, so... Oh, yeah, I unlocked a... Oh. I unlocked a good few, uh, side ops, so I'll need to... Sure, I do those. Alright. I mess it into a new. F I mean, Anvil is also menuing. He's not playing. <laughs> I, but but like, like, I, I'm ready. But you should to do Anvil, yes. Uh, but I have to wait for Ash to invite me. Yeah. Snake, Peace Walker is being prepped for activation in the hangar at the. I could probably the get away with a quick side up. Honestly, with how much time I take, yeah, probably. Well, welcome to the to my stream, Zero. I'm going to uh, play a bit of Puya. Invited Puyan right now. Um, prevents us from being abducted. Okay, yeah, yeah. We're gonna play the dumb side. Huh? What? I'm playing like one of like the joke side ops. You eventually. I unlock. invited you though. Oh wait, you're actually- Oh, I thought you said I- Okay, I thought you said you are gonna be a while and I should fucking do something else. Um, do I have to also play a side up? <laughs> you'll unlock the- the- the thing, like, eventually. I think it's after the final okay, AI uh, boss. Are you okay with this? I don't know if I have to- uh, I already bring everything I want. Uh, Oh, we're not doing the side up first? No, we're doing the side up? Which side up? The one where we have to bring our, like, weapons and gear to, uh, Snake. Oh. You can do that, yeah. Yeah. Uh, wait, which one is it? Oh, Snake, uh, Snake Gear Retrieval, I found it. Bad news. Yeah, yeah. Has fallen into enemy hands. I'm sure to fill in the plot the hole of, we just Actually, broke out of jail, but all of a sudden we're in gear. fully tactical gear with, like, six it. machine That's guns. <laughs> I need you to sneak in through the mine's underground passage and recover all oh. of the boss's equipment. I know you'd like to rescue him yourself, but have faith. This will be more than enough. I'll be watching you. Good luck. Okay. Host. Uh, oh yeah, I have to invite you. Yup. There we go, except... And why can't I... I cannot be snake. I have to select someone else. I'll select yep. this guy. You can't be Snake. Snake isn't even here. <laughs> okay, so I want to try out a gun that I just unlocked. For massive hijinks. Maybe. I don't know. It could be a complete waste of time. Um, Probably wouldn't bother with like too much shit. So I might want to... I don't think I'll bother with like putting a full loadout on this. I'm ready whenever. Yep. The way it works is because you're the host when you try and start it, there's like a 20 second um, like yeah, get no, your no. shit ready. But then if I ready up, nothing happens until you ready up. <laughs> Um, so it's only a one-way countdown. Not super fat, but hey. Eh, I mean, it's a it's originally a PSP for, like, game. It's probably for randos. So, um, look at what I got. <laughs> what did you get? Oh. What do you think this is? Bazooka? What the fuck? It's a gun that if I shoot you with it, you turn invisible. <laughs> oh. It uses the battery, so it has very limited... Um... Fuck, I missed. <laughs> you hear that? Gunshots! I do you have it. Being shot at. Going to alert staff. You really love that thing, huh? I I fucked up because I forgot to make sure the character did not have that skill on. Oh. 
Whoops. Oh, I got him right in the ass, so he instantly got KO'd. Nice. So that does Oh my still god, work. I'm an idiot. I forgot the button. Oh, what, the guy that the guy that ran up the stairs there. Yeah, he got me. Don't worry, they can't shoot you if you're invisible. <laughs> yeah, but I mean, I already. Wait, I don't. Okay, I'm out. <laughs> I always have to That's wither all. in the balance for this game. We're like the opposite of intuitive. Fulton recovery subject confirmed on board helicopter. Um, so now we just have to run around and find all the items in the room. Because for some reason, like, Snake's gear is just scattered around this one room. <laughs> Oh yeah, there's the guy up here. Let me uh, grab them. Oh, is it all in this room? I'm pretty sure it is. Okay, I'll just look around. Let me check the map. Yeah, we can't take the elevator, so uh, it is just this one room. Uh, is this the a console game? Um, it's uh, so it was originally PSP, but then um, we're playing with like the PS3 uh, HD version. Uh, oh, I look, I looked it up by the way. There's no like HD Metal Gear Solid One. Yeah, no, because there's uh, the Twin Snakes for the GameCube. Yeah, but the Twin Snake is like different, kinda. Y yeah, it just made it really dumb anime. Also, or Kojima apparently doesn't right. like it because it's not. I I mean, like, if I remember right, Snake literally fucking does some like Raiden super cyborg yeah. ninja level shit where he's jumping off a rocket. So I mean. <laughs> As I said, it's like they just made it very anime or whatever for no reason. Where is this last item? Hide until the elevator you just miss it at like the end. Or something. Oh wow, we did. Oh wait, no, is that it? Or no, is it I, just activate, like... I activated the elevator. Oh no, I got. Oh yeah, the last one was in the fucking elevator. I remember now. Oh, there's no one. But uh, it worked out. I found a schematic, so um, we got we unlocked something. So uh, that's okay. a positive. We almost Fulton it while invisible. Yep. So like. Uh, there's another item I also unlocked, but I haven't. Uh, I don't have the skill required to actually build it, which is like the stealth mat. So that one's apparently meant to make you go in like visible if you lean against walls and stuff. Um. And you can use it on like teammates and stuff as well, but I don't know how that works and. I'll need to actually find the fucking skill. Yes, I unlocked the revolver. <laughs> I have some manuing to do, I'm sorry. I'll try to be fast. Wait, why is it on this version of the screen? I want the... Oh, here we go. Back to low mode. What happens if you leave people in the waiting room? Um... I... Nothing, Nothing, it just fills up? probably. Yeah. I mean, uh, that's probably why there's like fucking uh, a bunch of slots in it or something. Or I guess like, I guess it just eventually it fills up and you probably don't get any more, but then sure there's... It's actually only 43. I thought there was somewhere where you could put a load of people. I guess not, but whatever. Um... Uh... Medical team, medical team. Oh, let's not even bother putting these guys in. 
You're fired. I, uh... Oh, I got some. Oh, these people are actually decent now. Uh, wow. I don't know where to put them. They're, they're way better than everything I have right now. Uh, Fair. I'll just fire some people and run them. Oh, I can upgrade the Gustav. Okay, I think these these two these ones get wait. So this go directly to the Intel team because I have space for them. Actually, no. Fuck you. Uh, you, you. What? You're fired. You're fired. I fired someone. Oh. Actually, wait, is that background noise getting picked up by my mic? Okay, thank god it isn't. Fired. Someone's like cutting hedges or something outside, so I'm like, can, can people hear a chainsaw? <laughs> Okay. What? One or more? Oh. There's too many people in this department. Uh, I'll fire this guy. Unless there's someone who's worth even less. No! Nope. I'm sorry. Pro poor Beagle, you're fired. You're fired. Not poor Eagle. Okay. Uh, main up then? Sure. Snake, Peace Walker is being prepped for activation in the hangar at the bottom of the base. Get in there and destroy the AI before it's activated. What else? Oh. Snake. Uh, invite and fail. I am already using snake. I already have all my shit. I can either have G curry or S curry. Not either. Not all of them. Only one type of curry. What was psych for? I forgot. Psych is, um, so certain bosses damage your psych, and if it hits zero, you pass out. So it's like basically like another way we can knock out guards. You can technically get knocked out as well, though it's only like certain bosses that can do it. Okay, what's the soda for? It says uh, provides intense refreshment. Recover Psyche in a small amount of life, automatically uses if life reaches zero when equipped. The soda? Okay. Yeah, so it's just a very weak healing item that heals more Psyche than health. Mm, I'll keep the Tortilla then. No, actually, maybe the soda remind. Mm. I'll try the soda. Did you need time? Sorry. No, 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 it's fine. I was I just uh, picking weapons. Um, so, from what I heard, the Japanese version of this game had, uh, instead of lime soda and tortilla chips, had uh, Mountain Dew and Doritos. Yeah, I think also on the PSP version, uh, probably in the Japanese version, you could get like 
an out uh, like the uniform with a t-shirt and it would have like the Mountain Dew logo on it or <laughs> Doritos. Um, Man, Kojima was a seller even back then, huh? <laughs> You can get the the t-shirt outfit in this game, but it's only a blank white t-shirt and you get it in like extra op one, which is target practice. And if you just run up the stairs, you just find it. Oh, this revolver just seems so small. I really want to use it, but I want to just shoot oh, I see. all of I see the guy. Sadly for him, he did not see me. Oh wait, we don't actually have to take the elevator down. There's two doors? Interesting. Wake it up. Oh, I see a POW. You do? Yeah. Pretty sure that's a POW. Oh shit. I got him. Oh, you got him. Nice. Who's left? The one guy over here. Oh, are you kidding me? That count as a wall? Fucking invisible wall bullshit. Stop waking him up. No. Reload. Reload. Okay, we're fine. Everything's fine. Do you need help? <laughs> no, 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 it's fine. I handled it. Oh, it's, it's technically a POW, but it's actually a restrained worker, I think. Because he's wearing, like, orange overalls instead of the typical POW stuff. Oh, we have to go down? Yeah, we can take this way instead of the uh, elevator, apparently. It'll take two people to get through there. Uh, the connection between Jeff and Kojima in the early days... So can you steal those massive mechs? Um, you can fight them, and then you can take parts of them and then make a Metal Gear. Enemies that coordinate their attacks are too much trouble when you're solo. Just oh, so it brings us to the upper floor. So the, we would be downstairs. Oh, POW. Found... What is it? Oh, well, you got it. Oh, nope. yeah, but I, uh, I forgot people are downstairs, so let me just... Oh, they're under the... Yeah, okay. Yeah. I missed! Shit! CQC! How do you even get down? Uh, I jumped down, but there is just, like, the staircase, right? Like, like... At the side. It's fine. The situation's out of control now. Okay. Is there anything else to get down there? Uh, just, just more guys. Um, What's the both stairs? Be... I'm. Okay. Oh, I see it. Recovery subject confirmed on board helicopter. Yeah. What about we first a plastic came... gear? Uh. No, those are those are in the there's the cool example. Well, I'll head back up because we might as well. Wait, can we go to the next area upstairs? Cause I say that'd probably be better. Just stick upstairs yeah, 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 so yeah. probably where extra stuff would be. You just continue down this, the hallway. Coming. Hey, where are you? Okay. <laughs> Master of Still. Um, what about the plastic gear? I don't know what plastic gear is. Um, the metal gear, but made of plastic. Oh. All right. Peace Walker can't be far. Hurry. Oh. Okay. POW. Grab them. They're right next to the door. Oh, shield. Nice. Oh, that was a girl. Yep. <laughs> I got him. Oh wait, do they hear me from below? Is there someone below us again?
I missed. Shit. Oh, come on. He moved right when I shot. I got him. Okay, I wanted to see QC. That guy but... saw me, though. Ooh. I'm not sure you can see QC with the shield. Oh, a guy, like, ran upstairs and then just... Fine, I got him. Ah, uh, annoying. Okay, so... Yes, you can. I think you can. Wait, did that? Can you... Mm. Well, they are, they are winning. Help! Oh. Yeah, probably better to just do the actual CQC. I always forget that you can do it. <laughs> Listen. Just slowly beating a man to death. Um, so I think that it'll just check this room real quick. Yeah, we're clear. I gotta be strong! <laughs> there we go. I knew I had got in, yeah. <laughs> No, it wasn't that bad. I was just cutscene over. Cutscene? Are we actually doing something? Uh, I think it's cutscene, and then it's um, next boss fight. Oh boy! There's a lot of boss fights in this part of the game. <laughs> it's too late, big boss. Snake. Boss. How the fuck did they get fucked? The culprit who led you here to begin with. Well, they talked about how like um. The professor and her went missing, and then the professor worked for like the KGB or whatever, so they're enemies or whatever. Oh. With the boss, you were loyal to the end. I'll grant you that. But your silence was exactly the answer I needed. Ten years ago, your mission was to kill her. And her mission was to be killed by you. She fulfilled her duty to America to the very end. Thanks to you, Snake, the final missing piece is now in place. And thus, the boss is restored to life as the mammal part. I thank you. Restored to life? You're crazy! I'll let you in on a little secret, big boss. You see, I've already selected Peace Walker's initial target. An offshore area in the Caribbean. The trade winds will scatter the fallout all over the surrounding region. Crops and fish will die, leaving plenty of free hands to help us mass produce Peace Walker. Oh, and wouldn't you know, someone's gone and built a pesky little fortress there. Now who would do that? Oh, that's right not good. In the middle of the target zone too. Oh well, all the better to test the warhead CEP. You bastard! I wonder who'll miss a ragtag band of pirates all the way out in the middle of the Caribbean. But first, we're going to prove to the White House that our baby can travel the Caribbean coast on its own. The whole world will know of Peace Walker's versatility. They'll witness the birth of a deterrent that can penetrate both communist and guerrilla controlled territory, traverse any kind of terrain, and deliver a nuke anywhere it needs to go. Untouchable. Unstoppable. The perfect deterrent. The Cold War's days are numbered. Deterrence isn't only about America and Russia now. You know what? You're absolutely right. While we've been wringing our hands, China, France, even India have surpassed us. There's a free-for-all nuclear arms race brewing just below the surface. The nuclear threat will only spread, which is exactly why we must deter it here and now. And the Peace Walker Project is the key. The advent of Peace Walker will bring calm to this restless world. Don't you see, Snake? 
We need nukes, control nukes, to have peace. Lies! Peace Walker will restore order. Order in the form of a new Cold War. But if the world is to understand the genius of our plan, we must launch! Snake! Stop them, Snake! Don't let him get away! Well. Things are escalating. It's almost like we're reaching an end game of some sorts. Are we that close to the end? Uh, it'd probably be like another stream after this one, at least, if not like two more. I mean, not like, the end game. <laughs> it, it's weird with this game, so I'm not sure we can reach like it by the end of this stream, maybe halfway through the next stream. But then, and then we get to the quote unquote end, but then the actual final mission is like after a bunch of side ups and then like finishing the mech and then you unlock the actual ending. Okay. So we're like in the end game for the actual game and then because after this fight, we're um going to like the final area of the game and then do a few missions there and then uh you know Boop. what what did i do god i love that low poly face <laughs> Oh, that's pretty good that it's just not unload a nuke on me. Well, well, not actually. It's going to like it's it. It's not that dumb. Well, actually, actually, why doesn't it? <laughs> well, because it would kill itself. No, it literally has like it's like mentioned later. It literally has a body that can withstand the nukes. <laughs> what? Uh, Don't worry, our M16 assault rifles can do the job. I I think it was the body. It might have just been the AI pod. But, oh, um, it's time for menuing. I'll be fast. I'll actually, yeah, no, fast. I'm wrong. It's it's just the AI pod, so the body would get destroyed. It's just the pod would be intact to be put into a new also, body. Don't you have menuing to do? Are you just done with like other ops and stuff? Uh, well, I I. I, uh, it was just like at the start of the stream, I had nothing to do because I already had it all done. Oh, okay. I always, yeah, okay. Um. I am more than halfway through the ops, by the way. <laughs> um. You might be, but like a lot of them only get unlocked, like, you know, a bit later. Oh, I see. Like, you unlock a few after um, we beat the quote unquote main story, and then when you beat the final mission, you get another huge bunch of them at once. Like, I think there's over a hundred of them, if I remember right. Okay. Ooh, that's a lot of people. Uh... Now, do I have enough money for this? I don't have enough staff levels to do it. Never mind. Um... Outer Ops, quickly check that. 
Yeah, when you get the mech built, you just get to send, like, a giant fucking robot to just do all the hard work for you. <laughs> You're fired. Like, yeah, it's like, here's my giant Metal Gear with a railgun, three infantrymen, and an M APC. Uh, perish. <laughs> Uh, what the fuck? How did this guy not get a job? But you're literally messing with me. <laughs> so, uh, yeah, we're now fighting the titular uh, Peace Walker. But this game is messing with me. Oh? Like... Fired. Like, there's like people that have C rank in research, and they don't get put in the research. <laughs> Where there's people with E. Maybe if you like, if you look at the uh, at the graph version of the screen, maybe it's like, despite technically being like, they could be a high C, which could be higher than a low B. I don't know. Like that sounds stupid, but that could be it. No, I think the skin is having like weird priority bullshit. Uh. It's fine, I'll just I'll just do it manually, but man You're fired. And I'll discharge these two. Oh yeah, what are your thoughts on people starting to exodus to Fire. kick? Something I <laughs> never heard of until it started happening. <laughs> uh, well, I saw the the nice check they wrote to Ninja. I thought it was XQC. Uh, sorry, X yeah, sorry, XQC. I mean, Ninja also started don't kick though, right? Uh, probably. Like, you're fired. I'm I'm considering do like doing some streams on there, mostly because I get so little I... like new viewers that I'm like, fuck it, I might as well try a different streaming service. That's yeah, it's not a bad idea. The problem is I don't like the company behind but the other side. Like, is Amazon worse than Kick? Is the question. I mean, Amazon is like one of the most scummiest companies. Yeah, but the other is an online casino. You're fired. Like, do you know why Kick exists, right? N no, as I okay. said, I only heard about it when everyone was okay. just exiting so, it. Okay, so a few months ago, um, Twitch uh, banned unregulated gambling on Twitch. Because what kept happening is that online casinos were paying streamers to play slot all day. No. Oh. That way, the viewers would go like, Wow, online casino seems too fun. Let me go waste all my allowance on that. Uh, Twitch banned it. And so, because Twitch source code was leaked a few months ago as well, one of these online casino companies took the leaked code and just made cake. And they just moved wow. all the gambling streamers there. So people like they started paying people on kick just so like they, they don't make money off of kick because they give like they give out like 90 95 percent of the money to the streamer. All they care about is that people watch one of the gambling stream and get addicted to that. Uh. So like, yes, Amazon is a shitty company, but man, I don't think I like the alternative any better. <laughs> it's either get zero money and probably banned for nothing or get lots of money if you get big, but uh, it's the scummiest thing on earth. Uh... Both options suck. I don't like either. Yep. Yeah. Please 
There's YouTube, but then that just has zero fucking traction full stop. Um, yeah, I mean, I feel like if you if you don't use Twitch, then you should do the ninja. Where you just stream everywhere at once. Yeah. Uh, I invited you. Oh, okay, there we go. But yeah, so basically the, the big alternative to Twitch are Kick, which is gambling, like online casinos, trying to get people into gambling. And then there's DLive, which is the a porn magnate. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Let me get rid of the gun. Let me get like a different gun. Yeah, it's an AI fight, so it's going to be like... I'll get this. And... Actually, I know it's a terrible idea, but I'm just going to quickly equip my uh, M19 revolver. <laughs> I don't know, I wish there was, I tried to look up how hard it was to like stream on your cell phone like a service where you pay them. Because the thing with streaming is like, it's quite expensive. Yeah. Uh, so I looked it up uh, to stream to the people that I stream for the time that I stream, it cost me about 30 bucks a month. I'm like, hmm, that's a lot of money. <laughs> Yeah. And the more people start watching, the more I have to pay. Yeah. Because of was... Like, uh. I had an idea actually to do something. I don't know if we. I. I proposed an idea to like send in the others. I don't think they would ever do it, but maybe you would be up. What if we. Do a stream outside Twitch or something, but we make it like a TV channel, where instead of having our own channels, we just share the same channel and we just stream at different times. Uh, I mean, sure. I mean, that's literally just what the Yogs cast do on their main channel, if I remember right. <laughs> uh, loading Ready on kind of does though, where like they, they're a single company, they just have different people stream at different times. And they have like they actually have like show's name. I guess the only thing would be uh what do we do if we're streaming at the same time? Cause it would only be the one channel. Oh we can figure out something. Yeah. I guess it depends on if we could just set up something where it's like multi screen or something, I guess. I know when the Yogs cast do it, the way they get away with it is that they do it in like their office, so they have like some a dedicated person that all they do is um, what do you call it? Uh, like manage all the screens and stuff, make sure mm -hmm. everything's working, and then like swap the perspective when it suits. Yeah, that's kind of what Loading Ready on does as well. They have the the person that just deals with the the. Oh, I am out of ammo. Oh yeah, by the way, with this fight, I think you can, you just can uh, focus where it does the most damage. Because I'll just be up front, we're not actually getting anything from this fight for, like, the the robot stuff, if oh. I remember right. Well, I think everyone I'm sh everywhere I'm shooting, I'm still getting the the same amount of damage. Oh wait, no, never mind. Some places I'm getting like 400. The oh, fuck? Like the mammal pod does like the most damage. So yeah, like, but the... oh, wait, can I just focus the pod? I'm pretty sure because I don't think we actually like as I said, I'm pretty sure with this fight because it's not the actual Peace Walker boss fight. It's um because there's still like a final act to the game, so it's a bit early to actually do the fucking final boss. I'm noticing if I focus like the ties that I get like 700 dead damage. I'm gonna focus yeah. those. Hello, Sentai! I saw your blurb. Ah, thank you for the. <laughs> Why I stopped the blurb of all things? Man. 
Oh wait, Get I need... him. Get him. I don't have... I am like, literally out of ammo. Oh. Sorry. The, the moment you stand there, I like, run out of ammo. I did not change my weapon. Oh god, it's pissing fire! <laughs> Who designed this mech? Michael Reeves? <laughs> <laughs> nah, that would- that would taste you. Well, like, he made a robot dog pee, like, alcohol, so, like, just put a match 420, let's it. go! Damn it. I was making doing 420 damage. It's not even that good, it's just funny. Oh, I'm stunned. Oh yeah, so that's that's the thing that you need to like um Can I pick you up? I'm moving my stick but nothing happening. It it's very uh, it takes ages. It's literally just that it takes fucking forever. Oh, thank there you. I need to run so you though. see, like, so it's like this is one of those boss fights where it's like you might actually want to bring like the tea with you to make sure your uh, consciousness bar doesn't drop too far, and then you just have to fucking lie on the ground and roll a stick for like three minutes. Okay, we killed it. How's it going then? We did it. We save the day. Oh, what? What do you mean? It's just walking away. <laughs> He's not walking away, it's down. Oh. <laughs> Man, Boston Dynamics be hitting hard recently. <laughs> See, I have like a face to or something. Wait, it's actually just gonna walk? Damn, that ass so round, it's a sphere. Wait, what? Why are they baiting him away? Because it, the, the helicopter said Peace Sentinel on it, so it's the CIA. Oh. But also, that voice was like Coleman, so it's like, Oh, fuck, he might actually break my mech. So, like, the helicopter shoots it, so it resets the priorities, and then he's just like, Follow me, mech! Please! Wow. For the love of God! And then, of course, the horse, you hear it off-screen, so they can cut back to, like, the fucking 2D cutscenes, because they have not modeled a horse. And... Estimated top speed on level 
terrain is 25 miles an hour. Come on, I bet you can do at least 30. Can I get Mochi done? Oh, let's go. She's our client. We have to protect her. Snake, don't let Peace Walker get away. The day is dawning. Go! Yeah. Oh, you have to fucking... Well, if this is more like, um... You have to position yourself correctly to avoid the missiles, and like you move to the left when you mash, and you move back when you let go. Or you can just mash, apparently. Well, eventually, that like they're going, like they'll hit where you would be if you mash as much as possible. I do like how it plays like a different cutscene if you're in front or behind the missiles. Yeah, that's pretty cool. Oh, fuck. Oh, I think got Yuri there. No, you! It's gonna run out of missiles stuck. eventually. I honestly don't know if these things can actually hit you because I feel like I got direct hit and it did nothing. <laughs> Oh no, it's slowly getting away. Oh, it's a script that I have to get away, okay. Yeah, yeah. Approaching the border. See you around, big boss. Holy. Look at that. Snake. That's the border up ahead. My guy just climbed a fucking cliff in like five seconds. <laughs> Friend shaped. <laughs> ah, the poor horse though. B. I got the I battle dress. Snake. Yeah, that's that's the outfit I was wearing. That was the fight that you unlock it in. I thought it was the one before, but it was that one. So in any boss fight, you want to wear that because it gives you more defense, so you take less damage, and you get to bring three main weapons. He's trying to figure out how the KGB plan to stop Peace Walker, and he thinks he can get the info from Paz. That's crazy. Paz won't know anything. Well, he probably doesn't buy that. You think Galvez has already been killed? By grabbing Paz, Coldman's saying, Stay out of this, or lose your client. Damn it! I can't believe we didn't realize what was going on before we lost contact with Paz. Don't have time for that, Kaz. Snake. Paz needs our help. Right. This isn't about money anymore. You better move. We know where they're headed. Yeah. You can thank Amanda. Snake, that river you chased the Basilisco across is the Rio San Juan. The other side is our country. I had some Nicaraguan compas track it there. They're focused from the GPP faction, so we don't work together so much. Where'd it go? West, along the border, towards Lago Cosibolca. There's a U.S. military supply base on the southeastern shore of the lake. 
Ever since that earthquake two years ago, America's had the entire region to itself. That is where the Basilisco is. I'm sure of it. Lago Cosibolca. How do I get across the border? There is a route that we use to cross. It's just a little boat, but I can introduce you. You can to literally fool to yourself, you know? I appreciate it. We will never leave Nicaragua. Well, like, that's for extraction, not for taking you to a U.S. military base where you'd immediately be shot down. Okay, fair enough. <laughs> Based on what Huey's told us, it'll take two more days to prep for launch. But it looks like there's another reason they picked that date. What's that? Tomorrow is day one of a U.S.-Soviet summit in Vladivostok. The launch is probably connected somehow. That's right. They're holding the SALT-2 talks. You think Coleman's trying to disrupt the negotiations? Either that, or use it as a bargaining chip. He's still got pos too. At any rate, we're running out of time. I'll figure something out. Well? Imagine being so pro-peace that you launch a nuke. <laughs> right? Uh, okay, I have some slight manuring to do. Let's charge these guys. Wait, what? Oh. Fuck, I lost the tank. Oh, that's annoying. No. Oh, that's, no, that's... I just lost the fucking tank too. God damn it! Uh... Do we do with the uh, the side off to get the tank back? <laughs> oh no. Well, like, to be fair, when we do the next few main story missions, you'll just be able to get better tanks. <laughs> okay. Because you unlock, like, harder versions of, like, I forgot all the I boss three fights, mon. you get what do you more... mean you forgot you have three mon? But that's the- what does that mean, <laughs> Sonic? Wow, Sonic only pretends to watch. Confirmed. Just oh, you were just out. lurking. Okay, I th I thought you like like. <laughs> I thought you forgot to end stream. Oh. Yeah, that's that's a big blunder. Uh, oh God, that's that's those are good units. We did unlock a, uh, another side op from doing that one, which is basically, how come that entire base full of soldiers did not run out to shoot us during that boss fight? Because oh. two guys stood in a car door and gunned them down. <laughs> That's I was ba it's cooking a thing that came up during the Mahjong stream. What did you cook during the Mahjong stream, actually? You never actually explained that. Still cooking? Okay. You're fired. Um oh yeah, we unlocked 38 base defense. So it's like we have to defend a point from enemies just charging us. Basically just just what it is. Okay, this person just sucks. So you go bye bye. You're fired. Oh Remember to let you like ping me when you're done with it. Because I want to see it. Okay. Okay. Uh, we're doing the next mainline mission, I guess. Yeah. And done with the menu. I guarantee everyone will love it. Let's go. Oh, actually, do you have um, side up 51 unlocked yet? I already finished it, too. Oh, well, it's like, uh, that's the one where you unlock the, uh, Monster Hunter missions. The obstacle demolition? Yeah. So, um, basically, when but you do it, it... 
Oh, you don't have 51. I have 51, and I've done 51 with you. Yeah, so like, the way you unlock it is basically you do the objective normally, you have to be Snake, and then you go to the no, beach. No, it can't be Snake. It says MSF soldiers only. Oh wait, do I have the fucking rock? Am I thinking the- which one is the Monster Hunter one? I'm a fucking idiot. <laughs> Uh, so, 51 is Obstacle Demolition. Oh, op okay, yeah, I got mixed. Okay, I got mixed up. Um, he's... Because, like, it's one mission where you just have to blow something up, so I thought it was that one because it looked correct by the map, but... Um, 29 it was, okay. I have you not have done 20... 29. You have not done it yet? No. Uh, but you have it? Yeah. Okay. Do you want to get unlocking that out of the way, or...? I mean, it's a single player only. So you have to do something yeah. else. Um... It, it takes like two to five minutes to do. The only thing is, you have to listen to every, like, audio, uh, piece, like, of, uh, Chico's. So you'll have to, like, mash through everything. <laughs> I'll and then try. do the mission, and then you'll uh, get it if you do it correctly. Well, you find something else to do then. <laughs> uh, well, I could just, I'll just probably just throw up your screen on my other monitor, and then just watch you do it, just to make sure. Okay. So if you go, if you go into briefing files, because you need to actually, like, I wasn't joking when you're gonna have to listen to a lot of audio. I'm on well, briefing. you don't have to listen to it. So everything that's Chico's. I don't have access uh, to Chico. No, you go over to the one that's everything. So like our one. Okay. And now you can do Chico. And then basically you want to make sure there's no exclamation points. You have to watch everything? I, I don't, I assume it's specific tapes, but all the fucking guide says is listen to every briefing file. Okay. Uh... Now you can mash through it, so you can press the circle button to like skip every line and then try and like speed through it. There's a reaver. Um. You see, the reason why you have to do this is literally because um, what do you call it? Uh, because Chico uh, mentions that he wants to become a hunter or whatever. So because of that, yeah, uh, that equates to it. on Crater Area. Did you ever hear? Uh, yeah. So uh, so it's literally just to be like, uh, "Hey, get it, Monster Hunter! You should listen to me, so you can then fight no. a Monster Hunter." Uh, dinosaur. What about the? <sighs> Upo Pogo. My guy wants to hunt the Loch Ness monster. I don't know if you mentioned that yet, but one one of his audio tapes is just that. Chico. I remember when I unlocked the fucking monster hunt missions. I actually just kept laughing because the cutscene when you unlock it is just so goofy to me. Gotta admit, I... Monster Hunter, what do you do in that game? I don't know. <laughs> I wonder. Probably play Mahjong. God, I, 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 there has to be a Mahjong fucking Monster Hunter skin or something for... And... <laughs> Wait, is that it? Uh, no, oh, yeah, I more. think that's the same one he's talking about. Oh, uh, no. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> just, just think about it. No, By the way, if I remember. Deadly, it's like the same one. Uh, when you, uh, like, when you do the Monster Hunter quests, if I remember right, they actually give you, like, some of the most, like, I think the best rewards are, like, some of the most, like, goofy stuff. Oh my god, because there's it's... so much still. <laughs> uh... Oh, you ain't this is not five minute thing. <laughs> you wanna know? 
I, d I don't. I think it's just the ones you're looking at right now. So how's it going, I Anfield? I, 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 I don't think. Uh, uh, okay. <laughs> what? Snake. Well, like a lot of that stuff was like auto autobiographies, autobiography stuff. I don't know if that. Be uh, oh yeah, no, that's the oh, about I section. Okay, <laughs> never mind. I already see there's like a subsection of the last one. Just, just, just. Oh my think, god! Think, it keeps growing. <laughs> <laughs> just, just think of the end result. We'll get to fight a dragon with assault <laughs> rifle. Don't you want to fight dragons with assault rifles and rocket launchers? Wait, what? There's no no extra? Okay, cool. I think I did it. Okay, so now you should be able to just do the mission. Uh, and... and then... Now, you do the mission normally until you have to evac, and then you ignore evac, and then head on to the beach. Stay out of the enemy sight as you recover those supplies, and don't get lost. Oh, I don't have the fucking... I forgot the gun for, like, the silencer. I mean, like, you you, you, you can just kill him. You don't have to do it, like, oh, you're holding a two-handed weapon. <laughs> oh. Um... <laughs> this guy's just staring at... I mean, just, you don't need to take him. Just... What do you think? Like, you don't have to take everybody. I mean, uh, to be fair, I'm surprised that assault rifle is literally just fucking one shot KOing these guys. Uh. Uh. Where do I go now? You just blow it up and then, uh. pick up the items. Okay, where's the beach? Okay. Uh, it should be like the only exit you can go to. You can pause and check the map, um, and that would also just tell you because it's the one location you can go. Yeah, so it's like head left. Yeah, just straight. If I remember right, if you didn't go here the last time you did this mission, or if you haven't, oh no, you haven't done it yet, right? Because there should be a schematic on the shoreline as well, or it might just be like a camo for the fatigues. Um, there should be some item on the shoreline. I don't see item. Um, uh, could have sworn there was one on this mission. I was just not all the way. At the the... Oh, oh okay. that way. Like it might be at the end there. Oh, I see. Like, yeah, yeah, I just see like, something. Yeah, yeah. Or just like a floating piece of paper or something. Oh wait, no, is that just a fucking ration? What the just fuck? Ration. Maybe you already picked it up at some stage? I don't know. I don't know you know. So I love how though, yeah, you did it right because you can literally just see one of the fucking cats from Monster Hunter in a little boat. <laughs> love it. What do I do? So oh, do I have you... to go from the pier? Okay. Yeah, you go from the pier, yeah. Because that's where the cutscene starts. someone else. Uh. <laughs> From the mission, so like... <laughs> yep. Sounds perfect. <laughs> I think we did. 
Okay, I should probably turn off the audio. Uh, that cutscene is just so funny to me, just because it's like <laughs> the same art style, but all of a sudden there's like a goofy, cartoony cat making meow noises. Yes, I mean, this game is great. I have the fucking assassin box. That thing is still like the, the highlight. Like, I could not uh, believe it. The fucking Assassin's Creed. Called yeah, it. it's, it's so funny when you uh, unlock it as well, because it literally slow motion swan dive. The fuck? Why do I have new people? Um. Well, it's personnel reports, so that could just be someone going to sick bay, uh, no, or maybe right. you got it's a like volunteer the, the or something like that. The people I fought in, uh, they are immediately going to shit. Oh, what the fuck? Yeah, so now we have extra op one two one hunting Rathalos. Uh, I t I attempted it once, and then uh, at the earliest possible moment, and then I got my shit kicked in and instantly died. Cool. Um, uh, you're you're a, a bit like further ahead than I was when I attempted it, and then there'd also be two of us, so it might possibly be doable. Sure, let's try. It. <laughs> uh, I I I do love though when you mouse over the mission. It's like in the mission details. It literally just has fucking copyright Capcom. <laughs> yep. Uh, oh, and yeah, the fucking map icon, it's showing like a cat paw for the island. I assume I don't need the silencer, right? Oh, no, yeah, they're like, this is, think of this as like another one of those AI boss fights, but it's a giant fucking dragon. Okay, I mean, one second. I, I am, I, I'm pretty sure we cannot tranquilize it. Cool. <laughs> God, imagine. Okay. I invited you. Uh, let me Ready check my in. mission prep. I think yeah, that she'd be put fine. On your new, put on your new battle uniform. You're gonna need it. Wait, what's the, the fucking uh, dress? Uh, it should be ba it should be called battle. It should be below sneaking in uniform. But why would I need this? It's worse than the sneaking. Special combat suit with high defense and main weapon and ammo storage provides a lower count index a deal for a mix of combat and solo sneaking. Okay. It's so you get more ammo, a third gun, and you take more damage. Fine, I'll do it. Like, Ash, we're not gonna hide from a dragon. Fair enough, fair enough. Uh do I take missiles? Um uh... I mean, no reason sure. not to, I suppose. I mean, you have three slots, so I usually bring a machine gun, a saw rifle, and missiles, so... Do I also Unless get a strike it... marker? If you want to give it a go. Let's try it. It's like, it, it works the same as a supply marker, except instead of calling in a cardboard box, it just airstrikes where it lands. Yeah, yeah, I figured. Yeah. What's the empty mark for? Oh, destruction. More damage? Just don't get hit. <laughs> uh, easier said than done. Uh, I'm just gonna bring every single healing thing. Where? Where's my? Where's the Monster Hunter cameo for? Uh, for uh, or the Metal Gear cameo in a Monster Hunter game? Why could I have a M16 assault rifle in Monster Hunter World? Uh, do we bring the love box for healing? Uh, it's the rescue box for that. Oh, do I have it? I don't think I have Oh, I do have it. Okay, I'll bring my rescue box. Just in case. Yeah, we, and yeah. I don't think I need... I might bring the shield, maybe. Actually, no, I don't think the shield will help here. Uh, yeah, probably not. It's good against bullets, but uh, <laughs> a yeah, cardboard player. box with a detonation device. Oh, oh is that like the explosive box? Yeah. That's yeah. The thing. Okay. I'll. I don't know. I think I'm running out of stuff to bring. Sure. 
Okay, I think I have everything I could bring. I'm ready. Okay, actually, let me bring uh, Doritos. Okay, ready. Do I have Doritos? Yeah, I have. Because I was like, why am I bringing Fultons with me when we're fighting a drag? Yeah, right? <laughs> Oh yeah, you know how you can um, cook in Monster Hunter to make healing items better? No, because I know I don't play Monster Hunter, but sure. <laughs> okay, well there's a campfire in this level that you can put rations on and you can cook them so they're better rations. <laughs> oh! The only thing is, it's during the boss fight. <laughs> it's about time. Let's go, Trent. Cooking is for stamina and monster hunter. Oh, okay. Well, like, I don't know, it's just... You can cook rations on a fucking spit roast fire or whatever, so... Oh, It reminds me of that popular movie, Godzilla from 1998. <laughs> oh, I should have done the fucking holy fucking shit, fucking dinosaurs, Jesus Christ, what the fuck? Um, that classic meme video from I think like the 2000s? I can't remember. Eat this, dragon! <laughs> I love that the mink, the, the, the. Oh wow, that took a lot of all of me. Yep. Oh god! It didn't even directly hit me, it just fucking flew by me and that was enough. Yep. Ah, I'm being mauled to death by dinosaurs! Are you roasting? Yeah. Is that why the music changed? Yeah. Can oh, you it's shoot the tail off? Can you? Fuck, okay, I just got rid of my rash. <laughs> because uh, it's considered a new item, and because I didn't have any inventory space, the ration I cooked went to Mother Face. <laughs> Oh, oh, this isn't going. This isn't going too bad, actually. We already got a bar down. That's better than I thought, especially because I was too busy. I am already food. on rations, though. Oh. Yeah. I technically died once already. I can't remember if we can shoot off the tail. I tried, oh, but it's not doing that much damage. Like, it's doing yeah. way more damage. Oh, wow, okay. Almost died there. It doesn't have a... Am I out of rations? Oh. Why do I not have enough that much health? Oh, fuck. No, okay, I still have, a, like, two. I love how it's, like, the vehicle missions, but instead of... It Summoning in more fucking soldiers, it's just summoning in fucking dinosaurs. What is it? Oh. Oh, it's, uh, I see it. You know, I'm gonna call in supplies now just so I can grab. Yeah, some actually, I should do the same. Ammo.
Oh god, it's coming. Ow. Don't pick my stuff. Don't pick this stuff. I'm, I'm, don't worry, I pick up my own rations. I'm back up to full. I was more the munitions. I was worried though, because otherwise I cannot hit him. Oh. There. And why is it not sounded like this? Well, with a saw rifles and rocket launchers. Yeah. Honestly. We're, we're actually, God, that just feels so cursed in my head thinking about it because we're literally just playing the fucking Monster Hunter movie right now. The Monster Hunter and movie? I, the fu you know the guy that did the terrible Resident Evil live action? Oh. Like movies? Yeah, he did a Monster Hunter one. Where the US military get isekai into fucking Monster Hunter. That is not a joke. That is the plot of the fucking movie. Oh god! Dodge roll! Dodge roll! Ah. God, the frame rate does I, yeah. not like that. <laughs> I am noticing, yes. There we go. Shot it down. I mean, we actually we're actually doing this, which I did not expect, honestly. You keep oh, getting it. run over. <laughs> oh. Oh, yep. I got rationed. I think the most fun part about the Monster Hunter quest, by the way, is that when I played it back in the day... Oh, we got the tail off! Oh, shit. <laughs> Oh, Do I'm out of ammo. To... Oh, okay. I seem to be fine. Do we actually have to do anything with the tail? No, we don't. Okay. Unless, I doubt... I assume that the tail's off. That's all that matters. I doubt it would be something dumb like you got a fault of it. But, uh... I think oh, we yeah. get an extra lock for shooting off the tail, so that's why I'm like, ooh, nice. Does the tail give you item? I don't think we can I, kill I, it. Oh, I think the tail gives you, like, a weapon or something, uh, if we manage to kill him. So instead of getting, like, a, the usual unlock, we get a bonus because we shot off the tail. Because I think, it, like, one of the weapons you get from the Monster Hunter quest is, like, a, uh, like, musket rifle uh, that shoots tornadoes. Uh, oh. So, I assume to get that, you have to shoot, like, the tail off of one of these bosses. So, I hope it's that one, because that would be funny as shit. <laughs> what? Where is it? He's flying around again. Actually, I want to test something. Ow, fuck! What did he do? Oh. oh fuck, why did I do that? I just point back shot a dinosaur with a fucking rocket launcher. Oh, do you need rescue? to... Well, it says that... In... Okay, so when you stay still in it, it actually does, like, eventually heal your health. It's just very slow. I wanted to see if it actually worked, and it does, so that's nice. Uh, I'll just use another supply beacon. Yeah, we got some time, I think, before he's gonna swoop down again unless... Oh, wait, no, here we go. Roll! There we go. Oh, I missed every single shot. I mean, it's almost done. 
Yeah, hopefully it's enough. Ah, oh, fuck! Ooh, wow, okay. God, he immediately did a, like a like 90 degree. Oh, nice. Oh, I missed. Oh, fuck. Oh, I'm, I'm unconscious. Oh, shit. Can I One it? start. Two start. Ah, fuck. I, I was I was thinking you were going to pat me on the back, but I got um, it. You overestimate how familiar I am with the controls. I mean, you just walk up to me and press triangle like everything I, else. In the it wasn't showing me any option. Oh, really? Unless you have to like do it knowing that it will just do it. I guess. Like, I don't know. That's what happened when I went up when you got knocked out. Man, that, that last fire is a lot. Oh wait, wrong gun. Oh. Out of ammo. There oh. we go. Yes, now that's a prize. Only a master hunter could bring something like that down. <laughs> A master hunter? <laughs> Is this a pun? <laughs> uh. I got Rattler's wing. I only knew caught messages. Mm -hmm. So now you not get the tail. Maybe you need to fold it. That would be funny. Oh god. I got Ash Puppy rank 3. Uh, I'm going to Google this real quick just to make sure. It would be incredibly funny though. Uh. Actually, I don't even think I got the wing. Please tell me it's not only player one gets it. <laughs> Oof. That would be awful. I, I I think it actually might be the case. I don't have a Rathalos wing. Oh, no! <laughs> um... And gets oh wait if the player defeats rathalos and gets lucky so i think it's rng and i just didn't get it and you did <laughs> oh my god uh whose fine cut is worthy of a sky king so aside from the clean an image of the wing as well as a model of your bio of rathalos it also unlocks the design specs for the fucking musket <laughs> Yeah, so you, you you're able you'll be able to unlock the fucking musket now, you lucky bass. <laughs> um, can only be the pub this one in R and D has Japanese Patriot skill. Um, yeah, I can't really unlock anything right now. It's like, well, like to have someone with that skill, you just have to get lucky and like just find somebody that act just has it. Um. But uh, the funny thing about it is, you know the way it shoots a tornado? Fired. Do, do you want to know something that tornado does? Doing a whole mission not to get what the thing you want is very in line with Monster Hunter. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Oof. Uh, do, do you want to know what happens when, if, if you shoot it and the tornado happens? Sure. Fired. The tornado Fulton's enemies. <laughs> <gasps> oh my god, that's <laughs> so you, cool. When you shoot the musket, it's a one in three chance of causing the tornado, but um, they get blown away to one of MSF's helicopters. 
Um, and if you use the codex shortly after blowing the soldier away with the tornado, Miller questions why there's a soldier dangling from one of the helicopters. So we're going main quest now, right? Um, sure. Uh, um, I have two more uh, hunting quests. I don't know if that's not. Oh yeah, like when we were doing that one, we unlocked the other ones. Um, so we have those as options as well. I think there's like six in total. Because uh, what are the other two that we unlocked? Rathalos, Twilight, and Tigrex. Okay, the Tigrex one? Do you want to know the funny thing about that one? If I remember right, it isn't actually a Monster Hunter boss. But what they did is they took Metal Gear Rex from the original Metal Gear Solid and just redesigned it to make it look like a Monster Hunter boss, like hunter hunt like job thing. Oh. <laughs> so it's a fucking mech that they redesigned to be like a living fucking Monster Hunter thing, if I remember right. Oh no, no, it's just another type of dragon. Okay. There is one that is meant to be fucking uh, based off of Metal Gear Rex, and then there's a Metal Gear Ray as well, if I remember right. Uh, okay, I am ready. Did I not invite you? I think I did. Oh, I we invite you anyway. Let me let me check because I got distracted by being like, oh yeah, you did. Um, I already changed back to my T stripes. Oh, yeah, yeah, you're right. Swap. It's nice having us as a loadout, so during boss fights, I can just switch to the other one. No, I don't. Decoy, there we go. Yeah, it's the handy thing about, like, certain outfits just having different, like, builds. Oh, sorry. You... Okay. Oh, uh, I'm ready. Oh, wait, no, I'm just a complete idiot. There's only three. And then the last one is the, like... Gear Rex is what it's called, not Tiger Rex. Okay, I thought it was more clever with the fucking pun. So oh, I they... didn't get the weapon you told me. But I... don't you have to research it, or do you just unlock it? Um, the musket. Yeah. Uh, you need to find a soldier and recruit them that has like the like Japanese patriot skin or oh, okay. skill or something, because it's an old Japanese musket. So you need someone that knows how to actually make a musket. Mm-hmm. Um, so it's like, you, you did the easy part, now it's just Take get lucky, I suppose. <laughs> when you reach the northern bank, you are in Nicaragua. I've arranged for a guide to get you close. Snake! Tigo. Sorry about the horse. He sure was pretty. Life's end. Isn't it beautiful? It's almost tragic. I've been waiting, Snake, for a long time. Boss. There is nothing more for me to give you. All that's left for you to take is my life. By your own hand. One must die, and one must live. No victory, no defeat. The survivor will carry on the fight. The one who survives will inherit the title of boss. Kill me. Kill me now. There's only room for one boss. And one snake. Shoot the horse ass. <laughs> Bad, no hesitation. No. Well, obviously, yeah. The boss uh, was a ruse. To be fair, that the, the only problem with playing this game first is I think it's like that is an actual scene from like Belgar Solid 3, and it's like done way better <laughs> in the actual game. So the operation itself was completely uh, expanded and revised. The authorities in Washington knew that in order to prove their innocence, they'd have to get rid of the boss. And 
that one of their own would have to do the job. The boss wouldn't be allowed to come back home alive. And she wouldn't be allowed to kill herself. God, that face of snake is just goofy. Most beloved disciple. That was the way that the government wanted it. That was the mission she was given. The taint of disgrace will follow her to her grave. Future generations will revile her. In America as a despicable traitor with no sense of honor. And in Russia as a monster who unleashed a nuclear catastrophe. She will go down in official history as a war criminal. That was her final mission. Snake. History will never know what she did. No one will ever learn the truth. Her story, her debriefing, will endure only in your heart. Everything she did, she did for her country. I love that you can zoom in. Her life and her honor for with her Ellie. Hand. She was a real. Oh, I, I, I completely didn't even know that you could do this. I knew you could do it with like the the older game or like with the other games, but I didn't know you could do it with this one because it was like 2D stuff. Not right. Key card doesn't look too bad. What do you think? Gonna need some help. Gonna need some help. Gets a cardboard box. Job done. <laughs> Can you hear me? This is Miller. Loud and clear. Got it without a hitch. Good. There's an airfield on the other side of the building, on the northwestern shore of the lake. That's where they'll conduct the launch. There's a communications tower in front of you. I'm betting they'll control Peace Walker from there. Guys, they're targeting Mother Base. Don't you think you should evacuate? Nah. Everybody here believes in you, boss. <laughs> All right, fine then. I've kind of gotten attached to the place myself. What about Amanda and her people? They've been taken to safety. We can't involve them in this any further. Good. They've got their own cause to fight for. And Snake. Don't forget the bad guys have got Paz. I won't. We're prepping a few backup units. Don't let them launch, Snake. We're counting on you. Dun -dun. Oh, I I just realized I did had fucking OBS minimized. Whoops. Does that change anything? Uh, it just means I can't see my chat. Oh, okay. In in the small chance there might actually be something there. Oh. Soviet soldiers. Oh. An American base. Something's wrong here. Keep your eyes peeled, boss. Okay, I thought that would just make me fall asleep. There we go. Okay. Did you get the guy? Oh. I got the guy upstairs. I got. Wait, who got the guy down? Uh, he's just standing there. <laughs> oh. Teamwork makes the dream work. <laughs> it's a kidnapper. Fulton recovery to helicopter is complete. I think we can just destroy that one usually. All we have to. Well, we, you'd be risking alerting people, but if you don't care, you can just do it, yeah. Fuck! I fucked it! Ow, fuck! What? Oh, when you when you blew it up, it like exploded in my face. Oh, oops, sorry. Cause I, Cause I was down here though. I didn't notice you were down there. <laughs> yeah, no, I I went down the other way. Um, There's another way. 
Yeah, oh. there was a ladder. Oh, wow, I'm... those guys just ran past me. They didn't even notice me. Oh, it's on me. Oh, fuck. Hello? Okay, he's down. Oh, God. Please fall asleep now. Yeah, I need three takedowns before they actually went to sleep. Ooh. Yeah, that guy looked a bit special, so uh, I assume he was like a tougher enemy or something. need two people to use an elevator. <laughs> I like how on my side of the stream, the only difference between the two of us is I took off my shirt. <laughs> <laughs> well, you're also a nemesis soldier. Well, on my screen, like, you don't actually appear as Snake, you just appear as an MSF soldier. Oh. So on my screen, we do actually look identical. Uh, Can you kill the thing with... It has to be, uh, actual bullets. Damn it. We're being shot at. Going to alert status. Understood. Quiet reinforcements. Proceed with extra caution. Nope, I shot you. Oh. Sorry, man. How the fuck do I get out of here? Okay, found it. Oh, that's a guy with a shotgun. That's two guys with a shotgun. Yeah, fuck. Damn it! Stop flesh banging! Found a prisoner. You know what? Fuck it. These are like the reinforcement guys, so I can, I'll just try out my fucking revolver on these guys. I didn't miss all my shots. Oh, another POW. Let's go. Damn it! Oh my, I actually might die because I don't have rations. Oh, I should equip mine before I, uh... I still have four Fultons. I have three. Uh, okay, I think we've cleared out the area in its entirety, so... Yep. Looks like this is the end of the road. Head for the communications tower to the west. Man, Hello, Say! How's it doing? I, lo hmm? I love this revolver just because of the fact it's a revolver, even though it's like... See, the issue with this game is I feel like I should never use a lethal weapon on infantry, but I really want to use the lethal weapons because they're cool. <laughs> yeah. I'm not using any of like, super cool weapons because like, I have never have reason to use them. I mean, to be fair, I guess it's a case of like I should be using the analyzer to check everybody, and then if I realize nobody's worth taking, I just gun them all down. Yeah, but it's just as easy to just get everyone and then fire them. But that should have went down. Ex fucking. <laughs> there we go. I 
you go to sleep now? No? Okay, will you go to sleep now? Oh, god damn it. Have you turned? That was dead on. Oh, I got his helmet off. Oh, did I kill him? <laughs> I got the red number for damage because he dropped off the shit, the stair. Oh, he's waking the guy up. Now, I think I might have found a way I can get away with using the revolver. If I shoot them in the kneecaps, then... <laughs> I can stun them and then I shoot them in the head. I yelled doing Ah, oh. oh, doing good. I've acquired woman. <laughs> I've noticed. Fulton recovery helicopter is complete. We play one of the most hunter missions. Yep. So imagine Solid Snake, big boss himself fighting a fucking dragon. <laughs> <laughs> God, I'm so jealous that you got the fucking Wrath of Love Swing. Fried from the two point. Oh my god. I mean, they're gonna come and just and just pistol ass. Snake. To pay Mark up. Can you hear me? See, I can hear you. Where are you? I am not sure. I don't recognize it. What about Coldman? He just left for the control tower. Said something about entering the final data. <laughs> Boss fight? They found me. Snake! Gaz. Snake, you okay? All MSFs ready to move out. They're headed your way on the double. Are you serious? There's a skeleton crew manning the base. Everyone else is en route to the base in Nicaragua. Skeleton crew, aka just who Yui, cause fuck that guy. <laughs> So wait, what's up now? Um, I think it's just like another mission, but it's like the alert's always on, and it's kind of like get to the objective while like everyone's trying to gun you down. So do we Fulton or not? It's up, up to you. <laughs> sure. I, I think there's also, I think it's like mostly that there's a time limit. Oh, then we don't Fulton. Well, like, I, I don't think it's, like, that bad. Also, I just unlocked a new uh, stun weapon that I'll be using, which would... I, maybe, may, I think maybe I will Fulton with this new uh, Fulton weapon I have. Or not Fulton weapon, but... Uh, sure. Non-lethal option. <laughs> don't worry about it. You'll see when we uh, do the next mission. So I'm just menuing. Yeah, yeah, I have to assign all these people as well. A handful of like decent ones, and the rest are just absolute garbage. Ah! Uh. Oh, oh no! Okay, I can replace this one. Oh, that's three choppers. Maybe not then. Oh, it's next fest soon? I have no clue. I don't keep track of the stuff. Might be.
god, fucking two helicopters, two tanks, an APC, and a guy called Ape. <laughs> okay. I got a mech, it'll be fun. <laughs> Uh. So the problem now is, well, this goes to Intel, this goes to research, this goes Actually, to combat. You know I forgot last week to do my recruitment, so maybe I'll do that real quick. Just do math. And you go to mass again. You go to combat, because I pretty much... Yeah, I do. You go to medical. You go to mass all again. And... You're fired. Dude, just go unconscious. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> You're fired. Okay, enough. I've done it. I successfully managed to recruit four new team members by brutally beating the shit out of them. The way Big Boss intended. Wait, no, you go here. Uh, I just moved someone here, but I know there's junk. So, Mr. Capybara, you're, you're, you're out. You're fired. You're fired! Ah, uh, this one is get fired because this one is already. Oh, uh, actually. I know there's someone in RD which is a really junk. Wait, you have a junk score. Never mind. Uh, then I have two, two, two. So literally, I just need to find. Yeah. You're fired. What the fuck? You're fired. Okay, combat has too, too many. Yeah, I figured I need to A chicken grunt is one of the, my units? Oh, well, not anymore! What? Okay. Is Amanda still hurt? Does Amanda uh, never get hurt? She recovers if you forcefully put her into sick bay. Yeah, I did put her in sick bay. But she's still here. <laughs> she has never recovered. I guess it must be after like it I managed to do it, but it was after um what do you call it? Okay, I'm ready. Uh, oh, okay. Yeah, I'll head over now. I got a well done ration in my in my inventory. Oh my! A singular well done ration. So uh, I had to control tower, I guess. The Walkman cannot be equipped. What? The Walkman is um, changing back in music. You, yeah, you can put on different songs and stuff. Why cannot be equipped? I quite... can't remember. It probably just has music in the background. When is next first? 
You can't you can't listen to J pop Ash while you're having your six shootout. That's shoot just out. today, Sentai. It's from today to next week. Uh, oh. can you send it again? It failed. I haven't sent the invite yet. Sorry. Oh, oh! I must have clicked your one from last. <laughs> there you go. Ah, uh, oh shit! I have to look at into Steam again. Ah, uh, oh, I wanted to do shit this week. God damn it! So this is now a boss fight. So okay, I'm ready when I. So people busting stuff. Yeah, I, again, I did not come have. Uh. Yeah, there's a whole bunch of game. Uh, I probably have to look it up. I'm ready when I. Uh, just give me a moment. I need to equip my new non-lethal weapon option. <laughs> Mm -hmm. Oh, they have a demo viewfinder? <gasps> Man. Oh, I want to play the... that. They have what? They have a demo viewfinder. Oh, it's the one familiar. game based on the Portal 2 concept. Oh, interesting. Okay, I'm ready. How do you have a demo of Ghost Trick? Oh shit! I I pressed the wrong button. Well, invite me again. At least we don't have to lie. I don't have to change this up again, so we can just go straight in. I invited you. Yep, just connecting. Yeah, there we go. Why is OBS telling me shit? Uh, did something happen? No, it's fine, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I need to actually check what's going on in uh, sale or whatever, what's like popping up with Next Fest, see if there's anything that catches my interest. Mm hmm. Usually there's stuff that catches mine, but I have to actually look into it. Are I there sales during Netflix Netflix or am I just dumb? I have no clue. Also, it's one week. Oof. I wish they would make it two weeks. One week's too hard to turn around. Wait, did the game default me to fucking Snake? It did. It defaulted me to Snake, so I'm just wearing fucking the boss. Okay, well. No weapon? No, it's just I don't have the weapons I fucking pick, so I just have. Wow, I missed entirely, dear god. The the weapon I wanted to bring, but for some reason it defaulted me to Snake again, uh, was uh, a shotgun with rubber pellets. Oh, I so see. I was gonna rush through this mission, go, like, just blasting people with a shotgun. <laughs> and it would be non-lethal so we could bolt in them. But uh, it was not to be. Oh. oh, I don't even have fucking Fultons. I do. Yeah, because it's like, this is for when we want the Rathalos, so it's like, I got fucking none of my shit. Actually, our, I think we might get the fucking main part of the game done today, and then if we're lucky, maybe we could do the fucking finale, like the last mission after, or like on the next stream. Ow! Shotgun. Found a love box. We have to get up to. Oh my god, that's a lot of errors. Yeah, it's fine. 
Oh, you can just blow the entire beat. <laughs> yep. It, it also gives us cover from the sniper who's doing that. Ooh, I might need ration. Okay. We got a POW. What? Where? Right here. I have three Fultons remaining. So I will probably not Fulton anyone unless it's like a POW. I think the next mission is just the Peace Walker final boss fight. And that's so not sure. the good ending. Sorry, that's not the real ending. It's it's like a ending, but it's not the ending. Yeah, because it's like... Yeah, this is the part I was thinking about because you see the doors closing in front of us. Yeah. So it's just we're running down this hallway getting shot at while the door closes. I dropped my curry instead of eating it. Uh, game? I don't see the door uh, closing. The what? Oh. I have to call the elevator. Yeah, like we're past the closing door now anyway. Oh, okay. So we're, like it's this thing in front of me here. Oh. Um. Okay. It needs two people to use the elevator. I assume I still look like a generic nobody to you, yep. right? Yeah, but I'm Snake on my screen, so I think that's the way it's meant to work if everybody's Snake. Um. Shut up, Cos. Lead. Oh, that went. Oh, that's why you said to shut up. Well, it's because, oh. like, if you go outside, you get the LMG, so I just use this thing to just shoot down the helicopter. But then he's like, no, you should be inside. Actually, yeah, I have rockets. I'm, I, I? I'm out of rations. Uh, don't worry, it's fine. Where's that helicopter going? Seriously, where's, where's the fucking helicopter? Oh, there it is. Where is it actually? Oh, I see. Did you get it? Oh, uh, it. Yep. Oh, oh you see, you... this is why we can't have the Walkman. It's playing music now. Heavens Divide. I think that was meant to play earlier. I thought this was meant to play during the fight, not after. Stealthy game. Just gun them down. We're trying to stop him from launching a new cache. Well, if you have any Fultons left, better use them quick. Uh... Uh... I have one left. Oh, well. What do you mean, take out those soldiers? Oh, it was because the body was still fading away. <laughs>
Man, I was so excited to do that section with a fucking rubber pellet shock. <laughs> yeah. Snake. Big boss, you made it. Too late though. The false data's already in place. False data. That's right. Peace Walker is designed for deterrence, nothing more. She is incapable of initiating a nuclear attack on her own. She will only awaken and attack when it's time to retaliate. Peace Walker is a weapon of peace, after all. First, we'll enter data for an imaginary Soviet nuclear strike on the U.S. homeland. After assessing the data as a threat, Peace Walker will automatically enter retaliation mode, selecting the optimal target from a predefined list. For this scenario, we have reverse engineered the false data so that she'll inevitably end up choosing the Caribbean Sea as her target. You're really gonna do it, aren't you? Know this. Peace Walker's retaliation will be the first and last of the Cold War. It is the only way we will ever come close to achieving true peace. All that is left is to enter the code. No! Stand down, big boss. You're late. Professor. Professor? Yes, well, taking over the base took longer than expected. I brought the technology. What? You provided the money and land. Center alone could never have accomplished so much in so little time. Zadarnov, you backstabbing son of a- Backstabbing? Correct me if I'm wrong, but were we not enemies all along? Do you really think my comrades were working for the company? Do you truly think we'd faithfully serve a pack of depraved capitalist dogs? What are you going to do? Launch a nuke. Target Cuba. Have you lost your mind? What would you possibly gain? We won't be the ones launching it. You, the Americans, will attack our ally, Cuba. What? Think, Coldman. We're on an American base, eagerly endorsed and supplied by a pro-American regime. What's the international community to think? The world will burn with anti-American sentiment. Communism will spread across Latin America unchecked. Ah! Let the age of deterrence be undone by the deterrent itself. Such is the Kremlin's plan. You son of a bitch! Us, come here. Shoot him. Professor Galvez. Hmm. I am Vladimir Zadornov. And Vladimir means ruler of peace. Now, do as you're told, boss. Don't do it! Remember what they did to you at their base on the coast. For what Coldman's done, he deserves nothing less than death. Boss, I I'm sorry! Truly a child of peace. <laughs> no! Wait! <laughs> Only fitting that retribution be delivered by a dead hand. You... You missed on purpose. <laughs> Your part in this isn't done. I need you to enter the code. <laughs> Doctor, the target is now Cuba. Please make the necessary modifications. And don't even think of resisting. I'll crush you, but only after I crush your beloved first. No! Not that! Cuba is now the retaliation target. Very well. Good. It is done. As for you, big boss, 
I've been watching you all along. You've performed beyond even my highest expectations. A true commandante. What are you talking about? Hmm. Why do you think I summoned you to Costa Rica? Had you make contact with the Sandinistas? <laughs> A true intelligence operative never gets his hands dirty. Need a revolution? Manipulate the locals into doing it for you. You mean Amanda and the Sandinistas? You've done well. You took a ragtag band of gorillas, children, and shaped them into a full-fledged, formidable army. And now, you'll truly become our century's most complete human being. Che Guevara? None other. A hero who, gunned down by the CIA, becomes a legendary icon. The Sandinistas will rise up in revenge, overthrowing the pro-American regime and wresting Nicaragua from U.S. hands. And the nuclear strike on Cuba, naturally, will be the last straw. Mammal pod data entry is complete. Dead at age 39. Just like El Che. <laughs> Ironic, isn't it? In the end, a legend is merely fiction. You'll die as the boss did, and become as did she, an eternal fraud. Go, go, go! Man, who knew the big boss had like an army? Yeah, right? <laughs> of the KGB. We will win our own victory. Hasta la victoria siempre. Amanda. Uh. We're home. Look, we're back in Nika. We did it, Amanda. I, I mean, Comandante. <laughs> they finally called her in. Boss, you hurt. <laughs> Big boss? What? I assume it's like just big boss and like, uh, I don't know. I assume Vic means big. You're a regular Joan of Arc. Nonsense. You're the hero here. You saved my life. You're the heroes here. <laughs> I never figured you for a softy snake. Thanks. It's good to see you. Wow, is that the professor? Can stay with us until she's that was Huey. And the professor. What the fuck? We'll find him a nice I, I don't know. Honestly. <laughs> I guess it's like that he's just sitting alone in Mother Base, just being like. Man, I wish I was there being a part of it. I'm not done yet. The AI. I have to finish this. That boss is a fake. I'm gonna bury it. We'll save the champagne until you get back. May as well celebrate peace while it lasts. <laughs> oh, we can just. I didn't bring her back to life because I was forced to. I wanted to know how she really felt. How it really ended. The boss is dead. No, she's alive. Some truths are better left buried. You don't mean that. Be honest. You want to know too, don't you? Whether what you saw and heard at the end was the truth. She'll tell us. I know she will. Thank you for stopping them. And I'm sorry. I can't imagine how it hurt. I'll live. I'm used to shock therapy. <laughs> God damn it. Very kind of you to say. I think that's meant to be an odd nod to three, where you literally fight a guy who controls electricity. Never oh, I thought it was about can. the fact that you got that you always get shocked in the torture chamber. Don't 
pick up a gun and let well that but like i think in three you get shocked by the guy who just punches you with electricity <laughs> So it's like uh, the angel of peace. Leave the guns to us. I mean, she didn't even really That's pull the trigger. Yeah, right. Remember? The army's leaving Costa Rica now. The mission is complete. Pass. Thank you. What about this fucking guy? <laughs> He's just in the helicopter slowly putting in the nuclear launch codes and nobody's stopping him. <laughs> What's that noise? <laughs> just the anime like this isn't even my final form. What do you do? <laughs> I should have killed you when I had the chance. Norhead's nightmare. Is about to begin. What? Peace Walker determines retaliation targets based on enemy nuclear strike data. That data can be sent to third parties as well. We got big problems, Snake. Colbin's activated the nuclear launch switch. What? And the target's Cuba? Yeah, but that's not it. The son of a bitch has screwed us all over. When Peace Walker was activated, it started transmitting the false data set to NORAD. It's using a spread spectrum MLF signal. It can't be blacked out, even by EFP. There's no way to tell the difference between false data and the real thing on a radar screen. NORAD will have no idea it's all a ruse generated by Peace Walker. They'll think it's a real Soviet attack. They'll pass on the data to the National Military Command Center. And Washington will have to choose whether or not to retaliate. This could get ugly. Unless we stop it, we're looking at a retaliatory chain reaction. No! No need to panic. The nightmare will end soon enough. What do you mean? Coldman's aim is for the bureaucrats in Washington to see the importance of a machine like Peace Walker. He's trying to prove that humans don't possess the will to launch nukes. Everything will be fine. They'll never retaliate. They're only human. Cuz, where's the president? Last I heard he was in the middle of SALT II negotiations in Vladivostok. With the president gone, nuclear launch authority passes to the next person in the chain of succession. The vice president's gone too, so after him comes the speaker. President. Vice president. Not one among them has the courage to push the button. No one willing to enter history as the great destroyer. In the end, it's not their lives that people value most. It's their reputations. The bureaucrats in Washington may not be able to retaliate. Peace Walker, on the other hand. She's loyal to the mission above all. And she's well aware that guaranteed retaliation is essential for nuclear deterrence to work. Peace Walker is the perfect deterrent. Cuba would not have been my choice of target. But you can't make peace without breaking now that Peace Walk has the false data, retaliation is inevitable. Are you insane? You think it'll end there? You're about to unleash all-out nuclear war. Somebody find out what's going on at NORAD. Mammal's got a connection to NORAD. We could monitor it with the right equipment. I've got you covered. I've got NORAD on the line. Sir, we're tracking unidentified targets. Current apogee, 20 degrees. Estimated time of re-entry is 2250 Zulu. Have you contacted the president? Coverall is not responding. Warning system checks out. No corresponding natural signatures. Data is assessed as reliable. Cut the data transmission. We can't say for sure Washington isn't going to retaliate. The only one who knows 
The abort code is me. I die. No one can turn it off. Even if they do strike back, I'm already defeated. I can only pray that my theory, my peace, is proven right. DEFCON 3. Get Zack on the phone. This is Crystal Palace. Stand by for an emergency meeting. They're at DEFCON 3. The false data and the nukes are both coming from the same source. You have to stop Peace Walker. The only way is to destroy her. She's entered launch mode. Peace Walker's rendered her judgment. The target is Cuba. Snake, don't let it launch the nuke. Oh. <laughs> That ramped up just a bit. <laughs> just a bit. Hey, is he boss fight immediately now? Well, it's gonna be the like next yeah. time on. Well, at least I'm pop properly equipped for <laughs> in the cutscene. Man, those cutscenes look a lot better when player one is Snake, so they right? actually have the HD right? face and not like the 2D, like, or like, like the flat texture I keep, eyes. I swear to God, every time there's a zoom on, on Snake, I glance at your stream because I want to see how silly it looks with the low, with the low uh, It's just too funny. I think the reason I'm able to actually pick any soldier is because I've already played all the missions, I'm assuming. A new plant? Yeah, so it's like, uh, you know, over time, it's just uh, Mother Base gets bigger and bigger. That's basically just it. Oh. Okay, I have some mining to do. Also, the music changed. Uh, like, I think to get the final mission, you actually need to have, like, I think it's your intelligence team to level 40, because then they build, like, a second plant. And then, like, that's uh, required for reasons for, like, the boss fight. Uh, or the final mission. <laughs> uh, oh, wait, actually, let me. Gun. A silent shotgun, don't mind if I do. <laughs> I'll upgrade the foul, why not? Anything here? Sonic Eye, why not? Whatever. Nope. Yes. You're fine! I love it. Oh, that might actually be a good pick. Um, I say that's enough. Let's see how my mission went. Oh. Destroy an APC. Well, destroy the APC. Oh. I have too many people here. Fire them. Uh, my Intel team is level 37. Yeah, it's like by the time you actually have that mission unlocked, you're gonna have it. Like, it's not, that's like, a, that's a requirement that's super unnecessary. Uh, I think it's like a just in case you've really fucked up. <laughs> okay. Uh... uh. Oh, that's a really good guy for my medical team. Holy fuck. Oh, wait, I didn't send people back into ops. Shit. I'll just go back to Mother Base, send them on missions, and. I guess we'll finish on uh, 
fucking peace walk. Yeah. Um, I'm just gonna go to the bathroom first while you finish up what you're doing. Yep. Um. I return. Okay. I am just done. Oh, nice. Perfectly timed. Snake, don't let it launch the nuke. Else? Revive. And fill. And I'll go with the armored one. So, battle, and I got everything. Cool. Yeah, uh, do I get something for Psyche as well? Instead of Little Till, I'll get the. Uh, the zero yeah, soda. Y well, like, if I think the best item would be the mat, or the mate, the really? like Latin America. Well, yeah, yeah but it's that's a, it's covers item. only Psyche, right? Yeah. The Dark Calorie Soda recovers both. And he also well, works like, as a Ration Way to Revive. At, it's not as good at, at either, but like, I mean, like, rations and curry, you're pretty much in the clear, I'm gonna be off. I don't wanna risk it. I'm just gonna go with this. I'm ready. Thank Wait, 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 no. Let me look at uh, my guns, actually. Ration, curry, mate, rescue box. Did I get better rocket launcher? RPG 7. Are submachine actually... guns good enough? Like, better than having a. Like, if the, if the FL better than having an M10? Uh, honestly, I usually. I go with the. Well, I've been using the M653, which is like the M16, but like the anti tank version. I don't know if you've had no, the option I don't have to build that yet. Yeah, you need you need to find someone with the specific skills. So I think I just got really lucky. Um, okay, I'll just go. Difficult to handle, but powerful. Let me check with the other gun. Low accuracy, high firing speed. I think I'll try... I have the Twin Barrel, but I don't think that's good enough, right? Um, Like, as I said, I usually go Assault Rifle, Rockets, and then Heavy Machine Gun. I'll take the M10. Um, Is the FIM the best one I can get? Oh, do it not... Oh, the Gustav. Or the RPG. 
Uh, let's go with the RPG because it has Let's go with this. Okay, I'm ready. Same. So because this is the actual fight, it'll actually matter when we're um like what where we hit and whatnot. Okay. I realized also the reason why we didn't get the fucking railgun from like the flying ship fight. It's yeah. because um if you break parts you get those boards when you're pulling out the slots. But if you break specific parts of the body, you don't get those for your mech um, because you destroyed them. So we actually were not meant to shoot the railgun if we wanted to have it. So we're going to have to be mindful of that when we do it again so you can get the railgun. Because that's the one required option. Yeah, but you have to do it enough part. to unlock the board, right? I well, like, you, instead of getting more boards, you prioritize getting the railgun, so you just don't shoot the railgun, and, like, for that... Oh my god, did the rocket fucking go in between the fucking... Oh, you have to uh, attack the thing? Yeah, 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 we have to... We have to take it... We have to deal with it before the one minute passes and it launches the nuke. Just kidding, we just have to disabilize it within the minutes. <laughs> So, um, yeah, that's the gimmick of this fight. It's like the same, the fight again, but, um, God, it has a lot of body parts. Jesus. Okay, well. Ow. Okay, I'm gonna hit the usual place between the legs where, it, like, if you, like, I don't, I don't think they're called the ties, but if you hit the things, it does 800 damage. Which is like 10 times more than any other part of the body. Oh, yeah, yeah. Because otherwise I do 70. But if I hit those, I do like way more. Yeah, it's meant to actually just be really tanky. Like, we already did one bar, so it's like, it's not like it's that bad and whatnot. Is he coming here? I got it. Oh, for fuck's sake, stop jumping! Going for a splish splash and it's taking a bath. <laughs> yeah, see what I'm hitting? That does uh, that's extra damage. Oh, yeah, keep in mind when it launches out those mines, you can shoot them out of the air. Also, those missiles digging into the ground, if we shoot them before they go in, they don't, uh. They don't get us. Oh. It, like, uh, Peace Walker will launch missiles that throw them to the ground, and if they go through the ground, they'll eventually resurface and then, like, blow up directly on us, basically. Oh, okay. Um. Where'd it go? Oh, there it is. Ooh. Ow! Okay. <laughs> oh, another bomber with one weapon. Oh, this is terrible aim. Fuck. Why did I think I'd actually hit that? <laughs> yeah, there's the drill missiles. Uh, I was too slow. Be careful of your feet. <laughs> okay, they both went for me. It's fine. No, one tried to go for me, but I was moving. Oh, okay. I thought it was only two. That did damage. Oh. Oh, you did five minutes already? Cool. Yeah, it's oh, literally damage. one rocket's enough. It's actually kind of a joke how easy it is to disrupt it. I think the hardest one's the first one, and then it's just piss easy the rest. Um. Oh. 
Oh, I didn't get the missile. Oh, I got the two in front of me. Um, oh, it tried to go for me. Oh, oh, it explodes. Yeah, yeah it's a missile. <laughs> <laughs> I was just standing there. Yeah, it's like you just have to keep moving and then you can avoid it. But uh, yeah. So uh, I'm out of missiles, so I'm sure my LMG will be enough to stop the nuclear launch sequence. Where is it? There you go. Oh, there we go. I have enough. Yeah, you can see the ass mines are kind of in that little like flying thing and then they like burst out of it. So if you actually like take it out midair, it'll uh, go off early and probably not hit you. Damn, I only stopped one of them. Oh. How are we doing on body parts? We haven't done any of these. Oh, we did most of the attacks. They are the the exposed like joint. That's so much damage. Oh yeah. What the fuck is the MP gun? Oh, oh gosh! <laughs> Don't shoot missiles at it! Don't shoot missiles oh. at it! But my missile is not guided! Uh, mine wasn't either, we're both using RPGs. It's just fucking force magic. <laughs> it's magnets, Ash. Oh. How do they work? I'll drill myself. Yeah. Actually, I should go for that box on the top right. Get more of those attack nodes dealt with. Ooh. No, my psych! Oh, are I you unconscious again? Yeah, I'm going psych. Where are you? I'm coming! Can you hear it? <laughs> yep. Thank you! There you go. You went. Oh, Jesus! It's pissing flames again! Yeah, it's the fucking flames that got me. I find it funny that fire just makes you very sleepy, <laughs> even not just burning in pain. I need to call in more ammo. Well, now? I think it's just that it's done. Or something? I don't know. Well. I will say this is going a lot faster because there's two of us. Because <laughs> I don't think it gets any more or less health when there's the two of us here. It's literally oh, just... Hit. Yeah, it's like need for speed drifts and all over the place. No, fuck. God damn it. I avoided my heart, <laughs> my shot. Oh, I'm out of armor. For the RPG. Yeah, well, let's uh, eat some curry. Top off my psyche. I am just bad with this rocket launcher, I swear to god, I'm just missing everything. Why is doing it? Oh, I have no idea. Nah, we, we, we already stopped it. <laughs> oh, it's okay. <laughs> like the with RPGs, it's like you literally shoot it once and it stops, like it's dealt with. What the fuck is it? 
over here, just waiting for it to drive by. Wait, what? I, I hit it! Can you deal with it? Uh, I'm trying. I don't okay, have any of Oh, there you go. It just took two. Well, I probably have an upgraded RPG, so it probably just did enough to do it in one while yours needs two. Ah, oh, I see. Parts. The sense is almost dealt Ooh. with. I'm gonna shoot the fucking sphere on its face now. Ow! Just keep stepping on me. What is this? The Shiva boss fight from Final Fantasy XIV? The hit MMORPG? Yeah, there we go. That's dealt with. Um. Its feet still need to be destroyed, as long as well as like the flamethrower. Uh, I think we got mo. I think we got enough nodes unlocked to not have to worry about running out of any. But Good God, it really likes to do some fucking drifts, doesn't it? No! Wow! It fucking jumped when I needed. When I started hitting. You know what, I'll just... Oh, not the MP exactly as the missile was coming in. Wow, it's actually... <laughs> oh, one of the missiles got through. Careful of your feats. I'm always moving. Okay. How is my chance if we can literally jump? Wow, how did I miss that? Fucking stop jumping, I'm trying to shoot your flamethrower. Ah. Oh, your psyche is getting a bit low. Ah, uh, yeah, my jump, yep, yeah, I got flamethrowered. I'm actually gonna die. Okay, never mind. Uh, don't worry, I got the amble lamps. <laughs> oh fuck! No, I got, I got fucking the duration sold me. But I think I'm out of ration now. Yeah, I'm out of ration. I'm coming. It's just it really no. wants to beat the shit out focus of me. Focus it, focus it's it. It's almost dead. I'm almost. I think I can. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah but you gotta climb into the pod. <laughs> yeah, don't worry about it. I'll call a strike to play beacon. Yeah, got a ration. Kill the fucker, that's the, the important thing now. Yep. Oh, I forgot. I forgot big time. Okay, I killed both of them. Oh, there's a missile to worry about. Oh. Okay. Nice. And 60 damage, come on! Oh no! It's turning me to stone! Okay, it's done. There we go. Oof! I kind of miss the Miku, you know? It stopped moving. <laughs> Snake, you did it. 
You stop the launch. Well, we can we can That's we can fight BQ again, but harder. To track the targets on radar. The or or just fight her again, because it would be easier than <laughs> Chairman of the Joint Chiefs, a representative of the Secretary of Defense and Congress have arrived at NMCC. You've only damaged the drive system. The data uplink still intact. We've got 1,500 Soviet ICBMs crossing the North Pole. Target region is confirmed as the west coast of the United States. Go to DEFCON 2. Prepare to launch ICBMs. How do I make it stop? Peace Walker is a fully autonomous system. Unlike the other machines you fought, its command authorities are all located inside its cerebrum, the Mammal Pod. We've got to stop the Mammal Pod. I don't have the abort code either. Coldman was the only one. Snake! Destroy the AI inside the Mammal Pod! The inner barrier protecting the Mammal Pod is designed to be as strong as a bomb shelter. What's it gonna take to get through? I guess an atomic bomb will do it. You trying to be funny? No! I'm telling you, that armor was designed to withstand a nuclear war. We can't get through to the President. The decision is on us. You can't be serious. There's no way I'm gonna wipe out the human race. This is the president's call. There's no time for that. We need a decision now. Huey, call NORAD. We have to tell them the nukes aren't real. I'll give it a shot. Forget the order of succession. If we're all going to hell, let's take those bastards with us. We have 12 minutes to impact, sir. May God have mercy on our souls. Jesus. Coldman guessed wrong. They're gonna go through with it! The platform sustained a lot of external damage. All we need is some pressure. Pressure? Sink it in the lake! With that much water pressure, even the tiniest crack should be enough to flood the innards. The AI pod is a mass of highly sensitive electronics. Short the contacts and the signal will stop. How much does that thing weigh? 500 tons. It's hopeless. We can't move that thing. Get NORAD on the phone. Incoming MERV warheads have separated. Estimated time to impact now, 11 minutes. Sir, we've got a call. The president? No, sir. Then who? He, um... Spit it out! He claims to be Big Boss. Big Boss? Patch him through. Mr. Chairman, I'll get straight to the point. Cancel the retaliatory strike now. What? The radar blips you're seeing are all fakes. No one's launched any nukes. How do you know? The launch data is fake. Part of an experiment that leaked. You weren't supposed to receive it. Your radar is showing missiles that don't exist. If you're lying, then we've got ten minutes till we're toast. We have to retaliate or more Americans die. The experiment was planned and executed by the CIA station chief in Central America. Then put him on! He's dead. I can give you his name, though. We need more than the authentication code you gave the switchboard. We need proof you're actually Big Boss. Do you have any? <sighs> All right. If you know the name Big Boss, then maybe you were there at the ceremony when I received the title from President Johnson. Indeed I was. We don't have time for this bullshit! Hold it! Let's hear him out. You were saying? At the ceremony. The DCI tried to shake my hand. I refused. What happened in that room is classified, top secret. Only a handful of people would know. He's making it up. Don't listen to it. Wait. Why did you refuse to shake his hand? Because I knew where my loyalty belonged. Everybody, listen to me. Those Soviet missiles are fakes! What? You're actually going to believe him? He's right. This is some sort of commie trick. No, it's the real Big Boss. Trust me. How can the you real know? Big Boss! I was the Army Chief of Staff back then, and I was standing right next to the DCI when it happened. I saw everything. I think the real ending is that you actually push it through to with the Metal Gear. Pardon? I assume the real ending Thank you. is that you use the Metal Gear to push the thing through the, to the sea. Um, it isn't like a true ending situation, like... Oh. It's just what happens after this. That...
This isn't gonna be some, like, bad end bullshit. This is just what actually happens. <laughs> Butterflies. She's calling to you. Destroy the mammal pod and the data will stop flowing. Please, stop her. Oh boy! Oh, we do we both have to do it? Oh! Oh, wait, oh. I think oh, yeah, for- yeah, oh, no. Are you doing it, or is it just- I'm just running random shit, but I don't, there's no- Nothing Yeah, there's I no actual symbols, because it's meant to be more narrative this one. I thought- I could've sworn we actually matter which ones we broke. I guess what you have to do, like, the non- Wait, are you doing it on your end, or are you just looking at- I'm doing it on my end. Okay. And I'm pretty sure you have to get all of them, because we literally have four minutes. <laughs> I'm trying, lady. I've only removed half your brain so far. <laughs> yeah, same. I only have four seconds, though. Oh, you have three minutes. Okay. Yeah, yeah, no. It's like they give you four minutes to do it, like loads of time. Because it's like it's just purely for like the fucking whatever, like narrative, like destroying it. A one-eyed hound, you say? A part three? <laughs> Close enough. There was an XKCD about Pi. It was funny. Well, I got all my boards. I got I one less left left, so I, I think she just did it sooner. Oh, okay. Well, that's, that's handy that only one of us has to do it, so it's not like we'll be out of sync in the cutscene. Valid date regions. Zero. Exit all done. It stopped. The data uplinks bypassing the mammal pod. Put down the gun! Come to your senses, man! The fate of the world, the fate of the Earth is at stake here! Why? I don't understand. Answer me! Tell me why! Answer me! Authority rests with me now. I'm ordering a retaliation. No, don't. It's the end of us all. Who gives a damn? I'm not going to sit here and die like a dog. If the Russians are going to kill my family, destroy my country, I'm taking them with me. You've seen now, Chairman. Deterrence is just a fool's dream. Why? Why won't it stop? Sometimes the body continues to live even after the brain is damaged. The boss AI isn't doing this. I think it's something rather more primitive. Reptile has taken up mammal's dying wish. No. Stop it. Don't just sit there. Stop it!
What do you mean the next mission? <laughs> you thought there was only Peace Walker Battle 2? You were wrong. There's Peace Walker Battle 3. <laughs> oh my god. I have to go to bed. Uh, it's, 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 um, it's not a proper boss fight. Like, we, we did the boss fight. It's more of like a fucking cinematic fucking thing, or okay. like, you know, a set piece. Okay, I wouldn't even bother with the menuing at this point. I mean, yeah, fair, actually, because sure. Let's just do it and it. Stop that data from being sent. Then next time we're basically just gonna be doing nothing but side up. That's good enough. I don't mind. Uh, yeah, it's like you will also be getting some really like dumb silly ones, which will be neat. I invited. Um, there's literally one where you have to go around and take photos of ghosts, so it's literally just fatal frame. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> yeah. Uh, okay, my stuff's still the same. Right, you got it. There we go. The AC, we gotta the AC, prevent oh all-out nuclear war. The quick brown fox jumped over the lazy dog. <laughs> Pie is about three. <laughs> <laughs> the close-up of those dead flat eyes. <laughs> so uh, yeah, we gotta we gotta stop it. How do we stop it? Just keep shooting and pray. <laughs> Do I target the, the thing as well? Uh, I'm not sure if it matters that much. It's li this is literally like we're just shooting the corpse and hoping it just stops. Like this is, we're fucking desperate. Please just fucking die already. Please, for the love of God. Cause it's like, yeah, it was like the the pod on to on the top of it was the one that had like the the actual AI consciousness, and then it's just like a shitty backup pod, so it, like hanging off the front, and that's the one that's like causing this to still be happening. I'm almost out of ammo. Are there any fucking supply pods for this? I don't think so. Okay, weapon one is gone. I'm going to weapon two. Designed to survive a nuclear bomb my ass. Our fucking assault rifles are tearing at a new one. Yeah. Well, the pod was, not the rest of the body. Yeah, but... Yeah. I just think Huey's full of shit, because fuck that guy. Uh. Okay. And there we go, boss fight done. <laughs> I'm actually it was actually a phase two, like Jesus.
seconds. I mean, if the US was gonna retaliate, they should have done it by now, right? They won't retaliate at the last second. <laughs> Probably, but... Also, it's fucking Miku. Wait, is that actually Miku? I thought yeah. it was just a generic robot voice. I think? I don't think it's Miku. No, I, yeah, you're right, might not. Nani? It's singing? Really poorly. Uh. So I remember when I was like, oh, it's cool that there's multiple of those loading things when there's two players. Mm -hmm. So, like, that, that loading screen makes a bit more sense when, like, you've actually played it two player. <laughs> What the fuck? <laughs> oh, She's drowning herself to stop the transmission. Some fucking iron giant level shit going on here. <laughs> of the damaged parts. Mammal and reptile were patterned after different parts of the human brain. When those parts were assembled together into one, they must have become capable of functional compensation. It's not using its head. Well, it kind of blew it off. It's using its heart. This is the fate she chose for herself. Well, we, we didn't blow it off. The, both of the pods are still there. Yeah, I mean, we tried, though. No. It's an empty head now. The boss's innocence has been ha Half empty. <laughs> Do you hear it, Snake? Do you hear the boss's song? You saw it, didn't you? When you went to space. That there's beauty outside of battle. At last, I understand. In the end, it was you who put down your gun. And chose instead to sing. 
They can all hear you. I know they can. And your will shall surely live on. That's what you wanted. So much that you gave up everything you had. But you couldn't achieve it. Isn't that right? And still, all you can do is sing. There's no peace to be found anywhere. And so, we can only keep on hoping. Hoping for the illusion we call peace. So, so Snake hanging off his bandana is meant to be some bot because that bandana, like he got from the boss, uh, of him finally letting go. But then it's like, it's never actually gone. <laughs> yeah, I know, but it's not still in like the other one. It's too cool. Well, it's it's gone in like. Mel your solid five, which takes place after this in Ground Zeroes, mm. but uh, like in this game, it, like they never they did they don't have a second model without the oh, bandana. Okay. So, um, so even in like the later cutscenes, it's still there. <laughs> So what did you think? <laughs> <laughs> Good game. How the fuck am I gonna play the series now, though? Uh, I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> so I, mean, I guess they'll uh, play on like a PS One emulator or something. I don't know. Like, there's no. Like, I mean, uh, Metal Gear Solid One is on GOG. Is isn't the PC version like flawed though? I don't know about the GOG version, but maybe. I'd say I'd say look into the GOG version anyway, because just being able to buy it for like a fucking tenner and then just have an official, like fully functioning version would be pretty handy. Then you have the HD collection because we apparently it. the GOG version is terrible. Oh okay, well never mind then. I guess PlayStation emulator, yeah. Um. But you, you have the HD collection because we played this. So that gives you two and three. Yeah, I noticed I, those. It's missing I one think, for some reason. It was, it's, I think it's because they only just did all the PS2 games. Mm, yeah. Because then you have four, which was also PS3. It was PS3 exclusive. I think it's meant to work on this emulator by this stage. Um... So, like, you'd just be using this fucking thing again. Um, then, what was it? And then there's five, which is just on Steam and Ground Zeroes. Though, I, I guess technically there is Metal Gear and Metal Gear 2, the, like, MSX games. Which I can't remember if they're in the HD collection or not. Because I think they oh, were just thrown in. There's a whole fucking thing of happens. Yeah, yeah, like a timeline thing. It's just basically being like, here's what happened, and then like some things thrown in. Like, yeah, Huey becomes a father. He calls his son Hal. The United Nation establishes the unit. Yeah, so it's like Huey is Otacon's father from like Metal Gear Solid. And then, um,. Yeah. <laughs> I see. Wait. Yeah, you see, there it is. So, Outer Haven is like the fucking final mission. Okay. Uh, which we have to do a bunch of like side ops to get. Because basically, I'm going to spell it out for you. Uh, like, every like side op or two. We get like a main mission, which is just do this thing in a different area. Then when we do all six and you have Zeke finished, um, you then unlock the final mission. So it's a case of 
But if we if we focus on making Zeke, we'd probably only have two or three of those like missions done. So like we're gonna be getting a good few side ops mm -hmm. done just to get through the rest of them, and then it's just the final mission after that. Oh yeah, Nikki, there is getting a remake. I mean, the, like, the the original version is, like, still viewed as, like, a masterpiece, so, like, mm -hmm. I wouldn't even say you'd need to necessarily wait for it. Okay. Uh, because I'm pretty sure 3 is most people's favorite to this day. Um, like, I love the gameplay of 5, but, like, it just always kind of sucks because, you know, it's, like, a unfinished game. Okay. Um, cause like I think they only got like they only got like two regions finished, and there was meant to be like fucking four in the game. So like half the fucking story isn't there. It just kind of ends. <laughs> cause like the the deal about Big Boss is that he's like the main antagonist of Metal Gear 1 and 2 on the MSX. And then, like, you know, the plot of Metal Gear Solid is that Liquid Snake's trying to get Big Boss's body and is make it using, like, and, like, threatening to launch a nuke to get it. Mm -hmm. Um... So, basically, 3 is, like, the prequel of, like, how Big Boss came to be. And then this and Ground Zeroes and 5 is kind of meant to be like how he became the antagonist of one and two of okay. like the msx games but because five was never properly finished it just kind of stops halfway through and then it's like yeah and then he, oh yeah look at sound effects department vocaloid vocaloid big letters but um so like the connection is never fully finished and it's kind of like quickly slapped together at the end because Konami were basically firing Kojima because he was like this is going to be my last game so they were like get the fuck out if you're done like if you're not making more uh situation man I I will say um I'd recommend that you'd play for last Really? Yeah, it's it's the last one in the timeline, and it's kind of it was like made to be a conclusion to the like entire franchise, and then he he ended up being forced to make Peace Walker and Five. Oh, so like four was meant to be the grand finale, so it's kind of like everything comes together and gets concluded. So like. In, and like they reference a lot of the other games, so it's kind of like I, I feel like like I, I think some people recommend that for that reason. And then Revengeance takes place after that, but Revengeance is a whole other yeah, ballpark. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I know Revengeance. <laughs> uh. Oh wow! Oh wait, you can actually skip the credits. <laughs> what you got? I cannot. Yeah. If you press start, or I could've. Nah, uh, I think because you've seen them already then. Oh, okay. I cannot skip them. F. I'm trying every button. Well? Oh. <laughs> I'll have to look at everything in next first to see if there's anything like what I want to play. And you know oh, what? Yeah. I might do. I might download all the demos, wait a week, and see which demos take. Because I really hate the ones where they put a demo and then they just take it out. And it turns out that in almost all cases, those games tend to be the worst ones. <laughs> no, really, seriously. I no no I believe you because it's kind of like 
Because it's kind of like they force you to like almost have to play the demo to then be able to try it, which then by removing the demo, people can't try it and see if they like it outside of that. And it's just like, well, the excuse is that the demo is like a, an outdated build of the game. Yeah. But I would like to say that CrossCode, the demo of CrossCode is a. It's not even like it's super old, it's like 0 0.5 or something. Yeah. It's still the demo of the game, it's fine. Let me check. Uh, it's the version 0 0.7.1 beta demo. It's all. Yeah. It's like, if they can get away with it, I don't get it. Like, you're just, you're just stupid. Like, I'm sorry. Um... Yeah. Oh, actually, I should remember to do the recruitment this time before I finish. Have you been remembering to do that? No. Is it yeah, very the, important? Well, it's just because we've been playing co-op, there's more soldiers you get Snake, from it you still after oh. you do a bunch. So you can get like five or six really fucking high-leveled soldiers for free. Uh, yeah, like, I'm about to get six, and they tend to have better stats than the soldiers that you just actually find in the field. What are you saying, Snake? I was wrong. Come on, boss. Everybody. God, this is not going well for me. She betrayed me. Fucking bunch up, guys. Jesus, let me just knock you all out at one consecutive go, please. And when she did, she rejected her entire life. There we go, okay. To that point. Grab you. Back. What do you mean? In giving up her life, she abandoned everything she was as a soldier. It also, um, I find that, like, if they, the recruit also gives you more female soldiers, and they tend to have, like, insanely good combat sc oh. stats if you get them through recruit. Then, yeah, no, I've uh, not been doing that. I thought that was, like, an extra thing if you cannot get them. No, no, it's, I think it's meant to be the reward for, like, playing multiplayer and co-op. Oh. By being like, if you do it a bunch, because like when I played this solo back in the day, you'd only get like one soldier for doing it each time. I literally just got six right now. <laughs> I had no fucking clue. OK, I'll try. Uh, uh, it's, it's literally you just have to knock everybody out before the time limit hits zero. So you it really emphasizes using the consecutive CQC, which is just do the grab to throw someone to the ground and then just hit it again and just keep chaining it basically all signs are her scholarship um, came from the KGB too even if they let him go she's not going to be seeing any though it does seem to have a bias towards um combat units not going to lie stay here for a while what is she think? she says she wants to help out it would only be temporary she's still in shock I'm still going through post cutscene and stuff. Okay. Yeah. Because don't take your eyes off her. What do you mean? It won't be. I like how that mission didn't even count to anything in terms of progression. So like, nothing got researched. No, no, no situations changed. Doctor Strangelove wants to come too. Strangelove. Well, she's out of a job now, and she'd have a problem returning to England. You can talk to her about it. Anyway, you don't need me to tell you how good she'd be for R&D. Two new members. We have one pass and one strange love. Yep. Oh, pass is good for intel. I think uh, um, Amanda is... should start actually healing now because after I did the last Peace Walker fight, I actually was able to fucking heal her. Cool. You're fired. Um, and then her stats will go back to normal. So dumb that that happens, but oh well. Fired. I need to kill someone else from the unit. Oh, you're, you're fired. fired. 
And I'll get rid of this guy here. You're fired. Oh god, I got it. I unlocked an extra op that I'm dreading doing because it's fucking really hard. Ah, because fuck. it's liter it's it's literally perfect stealth, so if you get spotted, it's just do it again. I fucked up and went to the other ops instead of the thing, and now I have to go through the fucking report. Yeah, it doesn't take long if you just fucking say no to everything. And I'm then trying, just it just it. takes time. Ooh. That's because it defaults to fucking yes for everything. That, that, that took longer than I expected, but then now... Uh... Oh, oh one what? died. Give me up it. Okay, I'm not going to send anyone to other ops. I want to do the stupid daisies. Oh, yeah. Uh, we killed the robot. Daisy, daisy. Huh. Looks like our reputation is spreading. We've got battle. Okay, let me do this. Uh, We're about to push them. What? I think, like, because we the robot got pushed into the water. Oh. Reporting for duty. Uh, I only got two soldiers, by the way. You only got two? God damn. Yeah, but I haven't been doing it almost that long. Well, like, the thing is, it's like, you're meant to get more soldiers from the more you do, like, like, co-op. You win this one. So like us playing together, maybe it's like yeah, maybe it's like the more you do it as yeah, well. Yeah, maybe it's just the more you do it. But um, or maybe it's like maybe you get more the better you are. I don't know. It might have the Star Wars Lego set Death Star. Ooh, but can you chug a sparkling water and not burp? Ooh, Ooh that one. Check it, check it! Check it! Hold it in! Oh my gosh! What do I do? What? <laughs> I was looking at the fucking thingy. Ah! Uh, Intel! Combat! And I'm sorry, you just go to the. Uh, who's fired? Right. Literally nobody. You're fired. Okay, I'm on level 39 no. Intel. This things. Pull to level four. Let's go. Okay, I can. I'm calling it here. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I, I assumed. I nobody. I I. I'm so following on Twitch is streaming right now, so speaker is done. Yo, can I borrow your pager and your ass? Can I borrow your beats by Dre presents the pill? They're coming. You're fired. <laughs> okay, who are we gonna raid? Uh There's two people playing Metal Gear other than us. Or we could go somewhere else. And Phil? Um Yeah, like either sounds good to me, like no one I'm following Don't is streaming right now. That? Let me check. Uh, since I proposed someone. I don't know them though. Come back here. Uh, we can... We can... Try to go to this, yeah? They're playing Mortal. Oh, oh god. <laughs> Jenny friend? Okay. Oh wait, was it... Was it the, the person today at the Mecca Watch Along? Oh well, uh, what's gonna be the message? Uh, uh, dub, uh oh, I should probably uh, get mine ready, Jesus. 
There's no cardboard go. box. Ah, oh. cringe. Okay, that's the one. Um. Let's go, you're fired. <laughs> there you go. This. <laughs> just, just, just raid somebody to just hurl like, you're fired. I, uh, that's funny. <laughs> Let's just do it. Oh, God. Okay. Oh, uh, I'll see you Wednesday. For cart, which hopefully was gonna be oh formula boy. cart. I have not tried it. I may ask for you to help test it sometime. Uh, I don't yeah, know. I'll just see. Give me a heads up and I'll if I'm available. Well, um I almost have to go. See ya guys. See ya. Bye.